Hello again, everybody. So here we are looking at your Chromebook. And if you're at school, it's gonna be all set to go. It's on the network where it needs to go. But if you happen to have to take this home and you're not familiar with how to get it on your own network, let's take a look at how to do that. Uh, I'm going to say maybe this is the first time you haven't signed into this device. And in order for Chromebooks to be signed in, they have to have a connection with the internet, which means they need Wi-Fi. So how the heck do I get my home Wi-Fi on here? Well, when you look at this screen, and if I'm really smart, I'm gonna put a picture over here so you can see it a little better, and I'll scoot over so I can make it bigger. <laughs> there we go. Uh, but down in the bottom here are some uh, buttons that you can click on. And when I click on it right now, it says US, and it has like a little uh, wedge picture. That's your Wi-Fi. It also has a battery, and I can see that this battery is a little low. I need to charge it and it's 205. But if I click on that, I'm gonna get a little window that pops up and has some more information. Now you'll see the first one I have here in my top left right now is my Wi-Fi. It looks like a little uh, wedge. It tells me what Wi-Fi I'm on. It may say none available. But if I want to add one, all I need to do is, sorry, like I was saying, if you wanna add a new Wi-Fi, all we need to do is click that little arrow next to the Wi-Fi name. There's a, in my case, there's a little arrow pointing down and that's going to bring up a, a new window here, a new little section that says network and it says Wi-Fi. I'm hopefully making arrows over to the side of me here and there's a little wedge with a plus. That's the one where I can add a new network. So when I click on that, for me, it brings up this white window that says join Wi-Fi. So the SSID, that is the name of your home's Wi-Fi network. And the security is, you're going to have to set that one because it does depend on the network, how you set it up. But once I enter in the SSID and I give it the security setting, I'll have the option to add my password and connect. And in theory, if all that information is correct, your Chromebook is now on your home's network. So it can access everything the same way it would at school. So that is how you can add a Wi-Fi uh, connection to your Chromebook for home use. Now, if you've already signed in, all the processes are the same. You just wanna start with where we clicked down by the time and everything's gonna be the same from that point forward. So I hope this helps. Thanks so much for watching and good luck.